This is my cello. I'm kind of obsessed with it, and it's new. Well, cello isn't new, but this cello is new, and I'm super new to playing cello. So let's get into it. So I started playing cello around six months ago, uh, and I'm 24 years old. Uh, and for context, most people who start playing cello are like six to 13. 13 would be considered actually kind of late. Um, and there are people who learn later in life, um, particularly a lot of people who take it on as like older retired individuals. But it's not super typical to learn it, I think, around the age I'm learning it at. So I just wanted to sort of get into the adult learner life of cello and talk a little bit about why I chose cello as the instrument that I wanted to learn how to play. So the number one question I think I get asked when people find out that I play cello and that I'm learning as an adult and that I haven't just always played since I was a kid is why cello? And I think it's a super fair question. And for me, it's super personal. I've always loved string instruments. Just the sound of them has always really done it for me. It's just like in a different way than any other instrument. Uh, and as I've gotten older and I was just like exposed to more music, the cello, the sound of the cello was always just, it really appealed to me. And I like would always listen to like cello covers of like pop music or like things you'd hear on the radio. Just like the sound of the cello was always really interesting to me. Um, and the other thing is, why didn't I learn it as a kid? Uh, because I was interested ever since I was a kid. Um, and the answer for that is it was just more than we could afford at the time. Uh, to be an orchestra in school, there were like fees and like fundraising. It was just like, it wouldn't have worked. And so for a while, I just like, from the back, like appreciated string instruments. And I thought sort of like, that the ship had sailed and that like if you are don't learn as a kid that you just kind of just have to live with it. Um, but like, I think my whole, like my whole like journey through young adulthood has been like doing all the things that I didn't think that I would be able to do when I was a kid. And this is one of them. And so one day kind of like very sporadically after reading like this book about, um, it's actually like a children's book about, uh, like orchestra and like music school. Um, I was like, I was like, oh, like, yeah, remember, like, you always wanted to play cello, and it's like, now you have, like, the means to do so, what if you just did it? And so I went online, and I found sort of, like, my most local um, music store with that specialized in string instruments, and I went in to check it out, and uh, the cello teacher, who I have now, just happened to actually be there in the main shop, just waiting, just between classes, and I don't know, it just sort of all worked out. It sort of seemed like it was just sort of supposed to happen when it did. And I have been learning ever since, and I've been really enjoying it. Um, it's insanely difficult, I am not gonna lie. Uh, I'm six months in, which isn't much time at all for anything, let alone the cello. But um, it's incredibly challenging, but like rewarding in ways that I would not have expected. And I will say that I have, like, actually been able to, like, do more with the cello than I would have thought upon starting. I'm not going to play any songs in this video. I'm going to make a separate video about, like, my six-month progress because I figure the audience that is interested in why I want to learn cello as an adult and the audience that wants to hear me play as a beginner might be, uh, there might be some mutual exclusivity in there. Um, so I'll make a separate video about that. But I do want to introduce you to my cello because I did, this is my cello, I bought this cello. I was renting a cello for the first two months to sort of see if I was going to want to stick with it because they are quite expensive. Um, and then I just ended up buying one, which was really fun and exciting for me. This one was like twice the price of the one I was renting. So I did kind of ball out on it a little bit, but cellos are just expensive in general. So I do want to let you hear how it sounds. I'm not going to play a song, but I just want to give you an idea. So that's generally like the sound. So like that's an, that's an A, that's a D, G, 
C. And so when I say that I'm an adult beginner, I, I like mean that like in every sense of the way. I never played any other instrument before, and I did not know how to read music. Um, starting from scratch, I had never even like held a cello um, until I like went into the shop to sort of ask questions. Um, that being said, let's address the elephant in the room, which is the guitar right there. Um, <laughs> so this was actually something that I got as a teenager, and I mentioned that, like, I had always wanted to play string instruments, but it was too expensive. So this was something that sort of, like, later in life, um, I had got as a gift from my mom, as sort of like a, you know, I, we had, we had been, like, discussing how I had always wanted to play an instrument, and, like, we went, um... And then, like, I think sort of as an economic option, uh, I went with guitar and asked for a guitar. Uh, and I do regret it a bit because my heart wasn't with it and I was just doing it because it was affordable. So I never had lessons. I just got the guitar and then I tried to teach myself online, which for me was not the way to go. I, I definitely am somebody who needs a tutor for everything. And so generally my advice for anyone who is considering learning cello as an adult or as a kid or at any age really, it would be to just do it. Do it because you want to do it and don't worry about uh, being behind or not being good. Uh, I'm both of those things and it's still been really fun. Uh, another piece of advice, if you can afford it, would be to, to truly, to get a tutor. It's just, it makes a difference. So yeah, I just wanted to make a little video sort of about my cello and about me doing it. I, I love it. This is an instrument that is as nerdy as I am and I love that. Nobody starts playing cello because it's the cool thing to do. Um, you have to really enjoy it. It's also super, super challenging. So this, is, this has been great for me. So thank you so much for watching. If you found this interesting, if you liked it, please consider giving it a like, leaving me a comment. If you have any questions, I'd be happy to answer them. And sharing it, that would be awesome. So thank you so much. Bye-bye.